Okay, so today we're going to be taking a look at this new titan called Nodens, nicknamed Noodles. And uh, yep, so we have Cyclone on here, and here are the modules. Uh, let's take a look at some of these stats. Uh, actually, wait, just hold on a second, guys. I got an email here from Pixonic. Um, I'm just reading this email, top secret. I wonder what this is about. I'm going to click on it, actually, and uh, see what this file is. Whoa, what the... Okay, so I know you guys are thinking, what on earth did I just watch there? That was pretty much my initial reaction when I saw the graphics from, you know, the trailer. It looks absolutely gorgeous. So we're going to be talking about that. So yeah, this uh, War Robots Remastered uh, trailer that you saw is sort of a new version, actually more like a really big update that's about to hit the game in the coming months. Uh, we had another big update uh, earlier this year. Uh, the merge of platforms iOS, Android, and Amazon, and uh, you know during that period, the developers did mention that uh, there's going to be some really big developments to the game this year, and uh, I'm going to be talking to you about that uh, you know in this video. So since the merge, uh, you know our platforms, uh, you know the players, myself, and other YouTubers have raised concerns to Pixonic about uh, the lag and the crashes, and you know it's been getting progressively worse. Uh, so basically, I think what's actually happened is, uh, you know, they've been working on this old coding architecture and, you know, based from, you know, what they've told me, it has its limitations. And I think, you know, that's why we're seeing so much lag and crashes in the game. So I think basically what has happened here is they've done a full scale technical rework of War Robots so that, you know, it doesn't lag. Basically, everything has been recoded, the entire coding architecture of the game. And I think, you know, while they were at it, they decided to, like, improve the models, the textures, uh, the visual effects, uh, the interface, uh, game mechanics. Uh, pretty much everything has been refined uh, so that it's a more stable version and, you know, there's less strain on our devices. So that's where they're going with this. I also asked them, you know, with these high-end graphics, what's going to happen to the players with older devices? Are they going to be able to turn, you know, these settings down? So, uh, you know, they don't crash and stuff like that. And they actually told me, yes. So initially there's going to be uh, two, you know, graphic setting presets, the ultra settings, which is basically what you guys saw uh, in the uh, trailer with the gorgeous graphics. And then there's going to be the performance settings, uh, which is basically what you see right now. It's going to look better than the current war robots, uh, but a lot smoother, hopefully with this uh, lag and crashes as well. So yeah, all of this is going to be expected to come to the game uh, this fall. I think that's when they are aiming to, uh, you know, release all of this. Uh, there's going to be a number of test uh, servers as well, uh, which I'm going to leave all the details to that in the video description and uh, probably the pin comment as well. Uh, the first test session is actually going to be uh, tomorrow, April 28th to 29th. And uh, these test servers are actually going to happen during the week, not on weekends like we usually do. The first uh, six to eight test sessions, uh, which they told me, is going to be focused heavily on fine-tuning the performance and optimization of the, I think, performance settings. And then they're going to move to the ultra settings, and then gradually they're going to have, you know, other settings as well. But uh, these two, um, they're going to focus on for now. And um, I think, you know, one of the other YouTubers actually asked him too uh, a question on, uh, does this lead to customizable controls in the future? And I think that's something that they are definitely going to, uh, you know, look at. Uh, but for now, this is kind of where they are at in terms of uh, the graphic settings, addressing the lag and all of that stuff. So, yeah, that's pretty much, uh, you know, the news I wanted to share with you guys. And, uh, you know, sorry for cutting you off with the uh, Nodens gameplay. I am going to be doing, you know, videos uh, for all the new content, uh, which if you are interested, make sure that you do subscribe. And I think that's pretty much it. So, yeah, if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet subscribed, as I said, uh, make sure to subscribe. And I guess until the next video, I'll catch you guys later.
Okay, so we've dropped in on Yamantau map and I've started with the uh, Leech Scourge here. So we have the Ivory Scourge uh, on this Leech. Uh, these guys have uh, gotten sent already. Just looking to see, you know, where my uh, teammates are. You know what, I'm gonna go straight for this guy here. Do that. Notice how he's moving off the beacon. It's gonna allow me to uh, capture this beacon and then, you know, hopefully spawn here. I'm gonna take that guy out. Let's take that player out there. And my teammates, uh, there's a lot of them over here. Holy crap. You know what? Let's drop in with the blitz. Try to get this guy as well. There we go. And now, <laughs> I'm wondering if I'm going to be able to actually get into the uh, center here. Ooh, we hit that guy really good. Uh, looks like these guys are actually getting our beacon there. Let's get this guy before he uh, flies here. So we now have two players in center. This guy is not going to be able to take me down. You know why? Because this blitz has a pilot and it's down downright scary let's focus on this guy next I almost have my full hardy here this guy's gonna focus me down so let's just wait and now oh geez did you see how quickly his health dropped there we go Trying to focus down this uh, falcon here before I go down. And holy crap, what on earth is going on over here? Nope, I can't even drop in over there. Okay, let's drop in over here. Let's use the nodens next. Okay, time to heal up my teammates here. Uh oh, this guy's gonna get suppressed here soon. That's bad news for him, man. Titans wow. Here. Okay, so we've just suppressed this guy. Just melt him up. I linked onto my uh, teammate there. There we go. I'm just reloading here before I move in and suppress all of these guys. Uh, we're gonna do that now. Oh jeez, there we go. Okay, so we all here now. <laughs> the thing is, we need to get into the uh, center. And you know what? They just dropped in with a. Uh, they dropped in with an Ao Ming back there. Actually, two Ao Mings. So I did suppress. I think both of them. I'm gonna move towards this beacon because this guy is gonna try to get our uh, home beacon here.
Let's uh, focus on this guy next. There we go. I'm gonna link to uh, the author here. See if I can help him out. It just linked to that player on the right flank. I'm going to move into center now with my uh, Nodens here. Try to suppress this guy. Let's see if I can burn this guy up. And this guy next. I've suppressed this Ao Ming here, so we're going to burn this guy up as well. Let's link to my teammate. I wonder if I can take uh, this guy out. I'm trying to burn through his uh, shield here. Let's take him out as well. Um, I think I got this guy with suppression. Uh, where's my teammate here? Let's link to him. Maybe I can get this uh, player here. Let's just move over the uh, the edge. Let's do that. Let's link to that guy. And let's focus on that guy way back there, if I can. Trying to heal my uh, teammate. Let's move on over to uh, this side. We need to get another beacon, guys. I suppress that guy. Um, there we go. Let's move on over to this beacon. Let's take this guy out. Um, 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 I got a link. <laughs> That's the only way I can heal. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, I suppress this guy. Let's take him out now. Come on, come on, come on. You know what? I, I notice it takes a while to lock onto a player, you know, with these weapons. Uh-oh. I did suppress this guy. Let's take him out. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. <laughs> he locked me down. So that was a really good run with the Nodens. And I will be doing a separate video covering, you know, this Titan. And uh, this is kind of how we stacked up uh, in this game. So 4.2 million, 15 kills, 8 beacons. And uh, let me see, uh, this player here I think might be on iOS and uh, this player here is on Android. So let's take a look at his uh, hangar. And this is what he's running with a level 16 Arthur. And let's take a look at the other team. So these two players are on Android it seems. Uh, this guy is running a level 61 Ao Ming. Uh, pretty much maxed out weapons, uh, close to it anyways. And his teammate, let's take a look at this guy. And this guy is in Champion League as well. This is what he's running. Level 12, Ao Ming. And uh, once again, let's just take a look at the honor points before we end things here. And there you go. So uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. Let me know what you guys think of the War Robots Remastered. Uh, version. I'm really excited and I think that about wraps it up. So once again, 
Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet subscribed, consider subscribing. Until the next video, I'll catch you guys later.